Hey guys, welcome back to Beauty by January. I am January. If this is your first time here, welcome. To so today's video, I am going to be showing you guys how I do a wash and go with my hair. And I'm going to be using all Miel products. I picked this product up recently from Walmart. It's from Miel. And it's got the leave-in conditioner and the twist and shout cream. So I'm going to be demonstrating these products in my hair i'm not sure if i'm going to use the the twist cream or not because i think i want to just do a wash and go but i will be demoing the leave-in conditioner um, and it also comes with a comb this gift set is like really good as far as the price it's only 9.99 it's over 30 dollars worth of products each product standalone is like 12.99 so this is like a major steal from walmart I'm going to show you the rest of the products that I'm going to be using in my hair. For a shampoo, I'm going to be using the Detangling Co-Wash from Miel. For a deep conditioner, I'm going to use the Miel Babasu Oil Mint Deep Conditioner right here. That's what I'm going to use for my deep conditioner. I think I'm going to use this gel. I'm not sure if I'm going to use the twist cream or if I'm going to use the gel. I'm leaning more towards this gel the Miel Styling Gel Honey and Ginger. This right here. And I also have this from Miel as well. This is the Miel Flexible Hole Edge Gel. So I may put a little bit of that around my perimeter. I'm not sure. But so it's going to be all Miel products that I'm using. So if you want to see how I do my wash and go, then keep on watching. So let's get right into the video. As you can see, I have a towel on my head. So I just finished washing my hair with the co-wash. This is what the co-wash looks like. I just used it to wash my hair and now I'm following up with my deep conditioner. I like to start off with section my hair into four sections. So I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna apply I've got my conditioner here. I just opened it. Ooh, it smells really good. It smells minty. It's nice. I like to use a generous amount for that section. And I'm just raking it through my hair with my fingers, trying to make sure that I'm thoroughly coating all of my hair with the conditioner. And it smells really, really nice. I'm gonna add a little more. And I'm just going to go over it with my Tangle Teaser just to make sure I've got all the strands covered. And you definitely want to make sure that you get it on your ends of your hair. So I'm going to add a little extra to the ends. Just make sure that it's thoroughly coated. Okay, my hair is completely covered with the deep conditioner. So <clears throat> this next step is optional. Um, I do this sometimes, sometimes I don't. It just depends on how much time I have. But it says to leave this in your hair for 30 minutes or 15 minutes. Um, you can sit it in a dryer. I personally... Um, I don't really like sitting in the dryer, but sitting in a dryer is probably the best thing to do for your hair to get optimal results. I'm back and I've rinsed out my deep conditioner. So my hair is still slightly moist, 
And now I'm going to go in with my leave-in conditioner. And I'm going to be using the pomegranate and honey leave-in conditioner. And I'm basically doing the same thing that I did with the deep conditioner. And I'm sectioning it into four sections and then applying it. I'm using it about that much. Mm -hmm. Smells really good. <clears throat> And I'm working it through my hair with my fingers. And that looks pretty good. And I think I've got it completely... Looks like it's covering all of my hair. So I'm going in with the gel. And I'm going to actually split my sections just so I make sure I have plenty of definition. So. Hmm. The gel has a nice smell too. It almost. It almost kind of smells like, I don't know, it's like citrusy, like citrus pop or, <laughs> I don't know. It's got a nice slip to it. So that's that section. Let me move on to the next. I love this comb too that came with the kit. This is a really nice comb. Um, I like the fact that it has the wide tooth comb at the front of it and then the back is kind of fine tooth. So this is a really nice comb. And it's giving my hair a really nice definition. And I am all done applying my styling gel. And now all I have to do is let my hair air dry. And I'm going to apply a little bit of edge control. But I'm not going to apply the edge control until my hair is fully dry. So I will be back in just a minute once my hair is fully dry. And I will apply the edge control. And that will be it. But... Pretty good so far. My hair looks moisturized and has volume and body, all while still having definition. So I really like this a lot so far. All right, I am back. And my hair is just about dry. Still a little damp in some spots, but it's about 75% dry. So this is what it's looking like. Still got some volume. And it looks moisturized. So I'm just going to go over the top of it. This is not a Mio product, but this is a product that I like to use with my wash and goes. I'm using some argon oil here. And I'm just going to apply a little of that all over my hair and I like to do this to break up the crunchiness of the gel and to give my hair a little extra shine and for the edge control I'm using the Mio Organics Flexible Hold Edge Gel. 
with certified organic honey and ginger. So that's what that looks like. Hmm, that smells good too. I'm done with the edge control. And I'm just, normally I would use my pick just to lift my hair a little bit more for a little more volume and give it a good shake. And that is it. That's the final look. So that is going to complete this video with all Miel products. Overall, the Miel brand, I'm really loving it. Uh, this is my first time using any of Miel Organics products. And I, I love everything from the edge control to leave-in to the co-wash. All the products are bomb. They're really good products. You can tell that it's like quality. Um, a little bit of product goes a long way um, and it smells incredible. It smells like edible, so it smells really good too. So that completes this video. Thanks for sticking around for the entire video. Make sure that you like, subscribe, share, and also hit the bell notification so you're part of the notification gang and you know when I'm uploading new videos. Let me know down in the comment box if you want to see more videos where I am doing different things with my hair. I'm thinking about doing a twist out next. So if you want to see that, let me know down in the comment box. I will see you guys in the next video. Take care, be blessed, and love ya.